everyone, Mary the Wanderer back again with another edition of Dressing Well Wednesday. Three tips in under three minutes to inspire everyday style. Well, this is our last video for 2020, and I just wanted to thank you all for your support as we rolled this series out. It's been so much fun, and it's allowed us to get to know you better, and we're so grateful for that opportunity. So thank you so much for your support this year. So I thought what I would talk about today is how to elevate your at-home cozy style just a bit. Let's face it, all of us are going to be in our warm, comfy clothes for the next couple of weeks as we continue to hunker down. So the first tip that I wanted to share is really about evaluating your PJs. And if you haven't done that yet, you probably have missed the boat a bit. I don't know about you, but I never expected to be in my PJs as much as I have been this year. It's been a little bit crazy. But if you are at a point where you'd like to upgrade that part of your wardrobe, I did have some tips for you. So what I like to do, and I love these sets, these bottoms and the tops, just because you can interchange them. So as you can see, this one has this nice gold message, which is kind of fun and kind of holiday inspired. You can roll out of bed, be comfy all day, and then pop on a pair of earrings if you want and have a very different look for your dinner, for a Zoom call with family, whatever you have going on this holiday season. These are also really fun with the wine glasses. They'd be perfect for New Year's Eve as well. So looking at your PJs, upgrading them just a bit is probably time well spent because we're in them so much these days. The second tip is if you're a little tired of your sweatpants and you want a little bit more of a fashion forward look, these cashmere sets are really popular right now. So we love the cream. Winter white is always a favorite. I love how it goes with the gray. It goes with wine really nicely, but they're definitely more polished and sophisticated than sweatpants. And the thing I really love about them is you can definitely wear them out and about once we're allowed to do that. You can put a pair of heels on with them, a scarf, some wraps, they're very functional and allow you to be at home, still comfortable, but a little bit more polished. So that's tip number two. Tip number three is all about your at-home footwear. And while there's nothing wrong with your basic slippers, why not add a little bit more style to your at-home shoes? These slippers, I love them. They're mules, they slip on, they have the shirling lining. Uh, you can find those with fake fur. You can find those, there's a lot out there with some fleece lining, but they're super comfortable, super warm. And what I love about these is the sole. I can run out for an errand and still look comfortable and casual, but be appropriately dressed for weather and you know pavement and things like that. So. Looking at your PJs, looking at your loungewear, looking at the shoes that you wear at home, and making sure that all of those pieces can be elevated, can be casual, and can carry you far once the pandemic is over. So those are my three tips for today. I hope one or two made you think a little bit differently about your own wardrobe. And I also wanted to invite you all to a very special program that we're having over on Facebook Live tonight at seven o'clock Eastern Standard Time. We're gonna slow it down a little bit. I have an amazing guest, Sonny Musser, who is one of my personal wellness coaches. I could not have gotten through 2020 without Sonny. And Sonny's gonna come over and help us really build um, really great self-care practices in our own home. She's bringing some essential oils to show us, and she's also going to lead us through a really wonderful year-end meditation. So I hope you can join us. I Really, it's going to be about um, reflection and renewal and really putting a bow on 2020 and allowing us all to kind of settle into our holidays routines with a little bit more reflection. So that's 7 o'clock Eastern Standard Time over in our Facebook group. If you're not a member yet, link in bio, and I hope we'll see you there.